hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to draw here in lucid chart let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here in lucid chart i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Drawing in Lucid Chart involves creating diagrams using various tools and shapes to represent your ideas visually. Now, once you are logged into your account, I want you to hover to the upper left corner where you can see the plus button. You can start to begin a blank document or create from a template. But in our case, I'm going to click the uh, blank document wherein we can start creating or drawing any elements here in our um empty canvas all right but of course if you wanted to start from um a, a simple template like brainstorming processes meetings planning research teamwork systems you can choose that but i'm opting to choose from a blank diagram now in this case right here what i'm going to do is rename the uh, diagram and i'm going to maybe insert a photo by clicking on this icon All right, so I'm going to draw something here by going to the shapes button. You can simply click the flow chart right here. You can draw anything here for a process. You can connect that with an arrow right here. You see, not only that, you can obviously draw something that resembles a um, dynamic and interactive arrow. Where you're in, you can connect that to maybe a shape right here. All right, so drawing here is very simple you can add in a swim lane if you want around here you can draw a, a sim simple swim lane right here so there's a lot that you can begin to work with all right you can also draw using this circle right here you can put in here maximize connect it connect the dots you can draw also a simple um shape like this like a note creating a workflow for you all right so basically that's how you use this you can draw another arrow you can rotate that into something and of course in the blank document to create not only drawings here we can create a dynamic background as well giving um a clean interface after drawing all right you can draw another shape right here to add to your diagram basically you can draw as many as flowchart and shapes as you want all right and that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video